All right, guys. So it's uh, seven something in the morning. It's late seven something in the morning, uh, Central Standard Time. And my hot topics and stuff, they open an hour early. So they open at nine, my time. So we're going to see what we can get, what's looking dope. I already ordered my Amazon products. They should be coming Tuesday, but they said they're releasing today. I don't know. I don't know. But we're going to see what I get. Let's go and see how outside is looking. All right, so we are in the car. It is raining, cats and dogs out here, but we're gonna have a safe drive. We're gonna get what we gotta get. <sighs> Hopefully this is all worth it. Let's go. All right, so we are uh, at Grapevine. Um, it's raining cats and dogs still. Gotta, gotta keep the hood on so I keep the braids fresh, but we're gonna go in, see how the line's looking and uh, Let's go. Makes no sense why it looks like this out here. It was just sunny yesterday. In fact, it was hot. I was sweating. All right, so I did get two cells. <sighs> FYE isn't open yet, but we are gonna see what they got at GameStop and Box Lunch. Um, Met Jerry's there. I'm gonna put his link like right here. I think it's on my left. Put it right there to his channel. Check him out. And uh, we're gonna see what else these stores have for me. Probably nothing, but we're gonna still see what they have for me. Guys, it is uh, barely, what, nine something, right? We'll go see what's in there. So, GameStop wasn't open, surprisingly. Um, really don't want anything else from these other retailers except for FYE to get the Piccolo, but I don't know, I'm just traveling around, just get some footage to see what all they look like in person because I only seen the glam, so to see what they look like in person kind of looks cool too. All right guys, so I went to FYE, got the Piccolo, and I got um, some pick guys so I could do some sticker swapping on some of these ECC exclusives, but we're gonna go back to the crib, I'm gonna tell y'all what y'all think, what I think. And I went to GameStop, nothing for me, but the gelatinous cube did look good. Like I said, not for me, so I'm not getting it, but it does look super dope though, so let's go. All right, guys, so I went to Gold Calendars and found the Chase. Super, super dope. I, I didn't expect it. Just went here on a whim and I got it. So super excited about that. All right, guys, so I did lie. I'm actually going to Walmart to get the Flock Charmander because I did get the Flock Bulbasaur so before. So I know I got to keep that collection. Well, I got to get it complete. I keep it complete. I got to get it complete. But I got to go get this Flock Charmander, Walmart exclusive. Hopefully I get it. We'll see. Take a quick look. Um... This is more sold out than any of the pops I've ever seen before. Just, just, just saying, there is nothing around here. Gosh. All right, guys, so I am back from my ECCC hunt. That's a lot of C's. But I am back from my hunt. If y'all seen previously in the video, I was going through uh, my local mall. Then I went to Walmart because, you know, I had to get these pops because my local mall, they had FYE, GameStop, Box Lunch, and a Hot Topic. While, obviously, the mall didn't have a Walmart, so I had to go to a Walmart. So, y'all already know I basically picked up. I've said it in two of my previous ECCC videos. Y'all want to see that? Uh, I'll put an annotation right here as well. Um, let's go ahead and get into what I got because I didn't know today would pan out like it did. So first off, I want to say earlier in the video, I did say it already, but I did meet Jerry's guy pops and pretty dope guy, pretty cool dude. We, we got to do some collaborating later on in the future, bro. Like we got to, we got to get something done. We got to get something happening. Me, you, Derek, all of us in Dallas, all of us, we need to get something happening like collaboration wise, video wise or event wise. I don't know. I don't know because Dallas Fan Expo is not looking really pretty right now, but we can only hope because... <sighs> My goal this year is to get all the Yu Yu Hakusho pop signed, and I don't know if I can do that if Chris Sabata ain't coming to Dallas Fan Expo. So we'll see about that, but let me go into my haul right now, guys. Well, let's talk a little bit about the FYE haul. I did get these two. I don't know exactly who these are because I don't watch Masters of the Universe, the He-Man cartoon, but I did get these two because they, ha they actually came with the exclusive con sticker, but obviously y'all know I sticker swapped it. I sticker swapped it with this bad boy right here. Look, 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 look. 
I stick and swapped it for this one right here. I did a bad job on this one. I do want to get an extra Piccolo with the shared common, I mean, with the shared exclusive retailer sticker, but I had to stick and swap it because my Dragon Ball Z Pops definitely need it, especially since the Dragon Ball Z Pops that they did release are green. So pretty dope, pretty dope. I'm glad that I was able to stick and swap it. I might go back and buy an extra Piccolo because I really want one. This Piccolo green chrome with both of his arms doing a special beam cannon. We already have like three to four versions of this Piccolo now, so. Now let's talk about my Hot Topic haul. So y'all already know what I got. These bad boys right here. Oh my gosh, y'all know how to put this in the vaulted vinyl protector right here because I did a sticker, but I didn't do a good job switching the stickers, but I did get one with the shared exclusive and I did get one with uh, the sticker swap. So happy about that. Hopefully I can get this one signed one day and I can just keep this one tucked into my collection. This soap pop just looks dope. I'm sorry, this soap pop, this is the best pop that ECCC came out with. But that gelatin uh, cube thing, Looks super dope as well. So if you're in the D&D, you're lucky. Okay, guys, so since it is hot cash season, I also picked up three more pops to add to the collection. I got these two right here. Y'all already know I got these in the collection because I got them signed, but I wanted a signed version and I wanted the unsigned version in the collection. That way I could have like a little signed display happening somewhere. I don't know where, probably in my new nerd room whenever I get it, but I wanted these two to stay in the collection, but I wanted the signed ones to come out the collection and go into like a little uh, autograph collection right there. But I had to get these two because... Well, I had to. And I had to add to my Attack on Titan set. So I got a Ymir, Ymir, I don't know. She was like $3, had to get her on Amazon. She's like five, pretty cheap common. Really couldn't miss out on it. It's, it's like $3, so what am I really losing? Now, 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 I know this isn't a con exclusive pop that I'm about to show y'all, but we was in the mall. We have a go in the mall and I guess I just got a recent supply of these pops. And so I had to pick this chase up guys. I had to pick it up. Now, I'm gonna start, I wanna start collecting more movie pops. Uh, I already have like Scott Pilgrim movie pops. I also wanna get the Us and Get Out movie pops. Obviously for a cheaper price, but I did get this right here. The box has a little bit of damage. Y'all probably can't see it because of the box light, but there is a little bit of damage. Y'all can probably see it like right here. There's a little bit of damage, but I do wanna collect the whole set of Us and Get Out. I love the movies, uh, definitely gotta support. And um, well, I just wanna get my movie collection up really and some of my horror collection up. I don't know yet about all that. But I do want to complete these sets because y'all know once I get a set, I got to complete it, guys. I'm working on that. By the end of 2020, I really want to complete most of the sets that I've started already. But I got this. I also got a discount on it because it is damaged. So he gave this to me for like 980. So I came out with a chase for 980. A little bit of a damage box, but there's nothing a better sticker swap can uh, help with. Plus, I'm not really tripping on box uh, damage like that because it's not like it's mangled. It doesn't look good, but... I can live with it. And then the last one we got. Y'all already know that I told y'all earlier in this video that I did already get my Amazon pre-orders in for the Vegeta eating noodles and the Flock Bulbasaur. So y'all know I had to do it. I had to get that Flock Charmander, guys. Charmander is one of my favorite starter Pokemons. I think he basically is my favorite starter Pokemon. I recently got the 10-inch one when I went out of town in Austin. And so this is going to go perfect. Now I have all three Charmanders. Now I just got to work on getting all the Pikachus and all the Squirtles and... I guess all the Bulbasaur's now. But nonetheless, I am happy to get this. Charmander right here, very dope pop. Um, why is he flocked? I don't know, Funko. Y'all need to get it together with y'all milk and variants and stuff like that. But that is it for the video, guys. I just say thank you guys for watching. Tell me what you guys enjoyed about the video. Tell me what you guys picked up this ECC because I know a lot of people, there was a lot of things that people wanted. I know some people will hit the Funko shop up for the exclusives because they were giving the con stickers and the regular share exclusive stickers. So I wanted to get the uh, Sky Pilgrim sodas, but I just wasn't really too tempted into it because I don't want to spend too, too much money before Dallas Fan Expo, but it might get canceled, so. And since you guys stuck to the end of the video, I want to say I am doing a giveaway on these two pops. Now, I know it didn't come with the, the exclusive con sticker, but it's two free pops that you could probably use for out of box or something. I will be selecting two winners. I'll be doing a Instagram, uh, I'll be doing it on Instagram. I'll choose the winner. So if you want to enter it, if you want to enter it, Put the hashtag, oh great dark sage, as my boy Fitz always says. I always wanted to use that as a hashtag, but oh great dark sage. Well, or great sage. Oh great dark sage. I like oh great dark sage. But like I said, use that hashtag. I will be choosing two winners and also put your Instagram at in the comment as y'all comment that. But I like to say thank you guys for watching. Dark sage out. Peace.